Hi, welcome to Ikate's Crossing. Right, today's message using the Mary Ellen Tarot. So let's, oh, first card we've got out is the Magician. Talking very much about your will, your determination, your sense of focus, um, what's going to bring, using your skills and talents, what are you going to bring into your life that allows you to sort of look beyond the illusion to what's actually going on. Here we have a sense of um, perseverance. It does come with a sense of courage, um, an inner strength that sort of allows you to persevere, to keep going, to have that stamina to not give up in some way. Um, you may be dealing with a sense of heartbreak or betrayal, something that sort of really gets to you, really hits your heart in the way that you actually deal with things. So let's have a look and see what else is coming through for you. Here we've got the hanged man sort of saying, hey look you've been sacrificing a lot of yourself, maybe you need to sort of give yourself a bit of a break and maybe look at things from a different perspective, maybe you feel like you have um, given so much of yourself by you know sacrificing who you are as an individual this is a time for you to actually see things from a different perspective maybe take a bit of time out um, just to be able to move ahead um, I want to say cut yourself free from those things that bind you allowing you to bring into fruition exactly what you need to take care of yourself to nurture um, yourself fully enabling you to contemplate the direction you're actually moving in and seeing that with achievements success um, enabling yourself maybe a moment of peace a sense of um, rest resting recuperation in some way this might be a chance for you to review and reflect in what lies ahead for you. So, whoa. Here we have the nine of discs. So it's also looking at maybe a sense of, I'm going to go what is above, what's below. So what's happening around you physically, enabling you to sort of see... Um, I want to. This is not the normal card that you would normally associate with the Nine of Pentacles or anything like this, but to me, this is about above and below, about seeing the the phase that where you are, how things intertwine with your health in so many ways. This is looking at a way to prepare and take care of your health to achieve um, a wholeness within oneself. Here we're looking within oneself to find a sense of comfort or a sense of wholeness in some way. So you're enabling yourself to sort of um, be led out of the cold, if you like, being led into what's possible in your journey. This is an interesting, whoops, interesting card. Here we've got the Five of Swords. So this to me is sort of like a birthing a sense of wisdom gained from one's own knowledge. Um, definitely from one's own perspective, looking at the knowledge or the wisdom gained. Here you've got this birth of something, so it feels like something's being birthed or coming into fruition. So when you look at this, I feel like it's very much looking at your physical health in many ways. You're looking at your thoughts and ideas and how you can expand and grow in those aspects as well. You might find yourself with some major impact in your life as well. It might feel like things are quite impacted in some areas of your life as well. So, yeah, so that's it from me. That's it from Hikaru's Crossing. Take care and blessed be.